RR, established in three drawers, has a descent off road, rear bumper, front bumper, uh, roof rack, rigid lights all around. All right. Hey, nice, dude. Knuckle off road sliders, trail tailor, rear wings, opposites, upper wings, remote resis all around. What's up, YouTube friends? We're out here on Sycamore Creek. We got Devante's rig. Uh, Lexus GX, uh, I forgot what it is, but GX. We got the Colorado, Sycamore Creek. We're beating on the trucks today. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. Easy. All right, guys, we're out here, uh, Sycamore Creek, having fun. Devontae's crazy, and this fucker's stock, so uh, we're just bouncing around. Fucking bouncing, we'll see where we stand. We gotta hit it. Oh, wheel drives, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Stuffed boys. A little stuffed.
Got down uh, Sycamore Creek. I dropped Kenny off. Uh, headed over to the car wash right now to see the damage on the side of the truck. Uh, my dumbass, the traction boards flew off and uh, landed on the side of the bed. So, I mean, it was really my fault, but fuck it. Oh well. Kinda had an idea that might happen. It is what it is, right? Big old scratch. We'll see how it looks. Let's just say uh, suspension companies they need to hurry up and get some new shocks for this thing because uh, we were hopping, hop, skipping, and jumping over there on Sycamore. It's just the stock shocks aren't you know meant for that really. So um, we need to get some type of long travel aid. Eh? Shout out to Devonte for showing me around Sycamore. Never been there. I'll add his uh, link in the description or somewhere on the screen here. He's got a sick rig. We were beating the fuck out of the trucks, but it was fun. We did a couple of water crossings. We did the Sycamore Widowmaker on the very left side. We did that one the same when he went up. I did that one too. I wish we had a better like type of angle for that video. It was really fucking tight, but we got ha we got mostly up there up into the canyon, and then we got stuck a little bit with the G80 locker engaged and popped right out and got up the rest. That was fine. But other than that, she did really good. Need to upgrade the suspension. Definitely, it's gonna be the next one. Sorry guys, uh, we didn't go to Sedona this time. I forgot I have a, I had a tattoo appointment. I got the chest blasted on Saturday, so totally forgot that was happening. So we got the chest blasted. Um, she was hurting a little bit while I was uh, hitting the bumps. My titties were bouncing. That shit was hurting really bad, but we're fine. Here's the damage right here. A little bit dirty on the black truck, especially back there, but that's the fucking scratch. Ouchie. All right, guys, since I'm sitting in here doing a car wash, just maybe give you a little rundown of what's the, how the truck is and um, the air down mode, it's nice. It works sometimes. I mean, it definitely needs like a <clears throat> software update or something because sometimes it doesn't honk when it hits pressure. Um, but the good thing is sometimes when you're trying to air up as well, like after you're done hitting the trail and everything and you need to air up, you can bring it back to 35 PSI and push air down mode. And then 
once you pump your tires up to 35, it'll honk sometimes. But I mean, I don't know what the deal is with that, but it works sometimes. It's convenient when it's there, but it's nice to be able to like keep it on the screen. Like, let's say I go here, continue, and then I have this rolling. So all my, mine are all fucked up because I was at the gas station and the gas station won't suck. But see how right I hit 38 and it didn't honk, but I just left it because I was on a, it was hot as, it was hot as balls outside, all right? So I just, fuck it, whatever. A couple of PSI is not going to change, but, um, but I can keep that up there while I'm going around every tire and I can look in the window and it'll tell me where it's at, which is nice, but sometimes it doesn't honk, but it's convenient train mode really helped out when we were on uh the Widowmaker. we were on the Widowmaker trail or the climb that really helped um going through going up other than that the cameras are nice they do work but most of the time i'm looking at the windshield and not the cameras but they're they're nice just in case you're going over something steep well boys here's the dinger I think I could probably maybe buff this out, but this one's fucked. That one's fucked. We're down to the bare metal right there. Down to the bare metal. But, oh well, we bought it to have fun, right? Fuck it. Yeah, hope you guys uh, like this video. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. I love you guys. Thanks for all the inspiring words and all the love you guys are giving me. I'm gonna keep coming out with videos if you guys keep watching. Thank you.